Welcome, young explorers, to a journey through the wonders of nature. Today, we are going to unveil the mysteries of ecosystems as we voyage through various biomes and habitats. Our first stop is the diverse world of biomes. It is a large community of plants and animals living together in distinct regions, each with its unique climate, soil, and living conditions. There are major biomes like forests, grasslands, deserts, tundra, and aquatic biomes. The forest biome is one of the major types of biomes found on Earth, where there are lots of trees and plants. It's really important for the planet because it helps keep the climate right, protects the soil, and supports many different kinds of animals. The grassland is a big open space with lots of grasses and plants. There are not many trees or bushes there, but it's full of different kinds of animals that eat plants. They also help keep the planet healthy by taking care of the soil and carbon cycle. People use them for food and to feed their cows. Now onto the deserts, where life thrives against all odds. The desert biome is a special place because it doesn't get much rain and it's very dry. But even though it's hard, there are many kinds of plants and animals that can live there. They have learned how to survive in these tough conditions. The tundra biome is one of the toughest places on Earth. Usually found in cold areas like the Arctic or high mountains. But even though it's hard, there are many kinds of plants and animals that can live there. Because they have learned how to survive in these conditions. The aquatic biome is a big and varied ecosystem that includes all water on Earth. It is divided into two main parts, freshwater and marine. Each with its own special features and animals. This biome is important because it supports many kinds of plants and animals and helps regulate the global climate. We have seen that a biome is a large area that has a particular climate, plants, and animals. Biomes are big regions like deserts, forests, or grasslands. They have a broad type of environment that is similar all over. On the other hand, a habitat is a specific place within a biome where certain plants and animals live. It is like a smaller home within a big neighborhood. For example, within a forest biome, the big neighborhood, there could be a pond habitat. The smaller home, where ducks and frogs live. Wow, explorers. We've traveled through big neighborhoods called biomes. Like forests and deserts, and discovered cozy homes within them called habitats. Our journey helps us learn about our wonderful Earth. Keep exploring, keep asking questions, and most importantly, keep learning. See you on our next adventure.